So I'm Derek Snyder, Product Manager, Mobile Communications Business at Microsoft. I want to talk to you about what we're doing to really make the web browsing experience first class on Windows Mobile. Let's go to the device. What we've got here is a Samsung i780 that's running Windows Mobile 6.1 with an update that gives you full desktop-like web browsing. Incidentally, Microsoft makes a few desktop web browsers, Internet Explorer 6, Internet Explorer 7, and so we brought that same technology and ported it to Windows Mobile. So literally, this is rendering the exact same way it would on desktop uh, Internet Explorer. And so it's very easy for me as I start scrolling around on this device, I can start zooming in, I can find, um, you know, articles, you know, and just like that I can zoom in, you can see that the page comes alive and I can start reading it. Uh, on a large screen device, this gets really good. So, for instance, here's my Facebook page. But obviously, this is a PGA screen, and you can see it really does look just like it does on the desktop. And everything works the way you'd expect. It's got full support for web two o stuff, so all the Ajax works. If I start a search for somebody, it brings down the drop-down menu just like I'd expect. And kind of the ultimate expression of this is to be able to play the real websites. And so I've gone to YouTube.com here on this device, and you'll see that we actually have out-of-the-box Adobe Flash support, so that it can actually play with full audio and video clips from YouTube. So that's really the litmus test for a full web browsing experience. It's not enough to just make sure photos look good and tables and colors and everything else. You want to make sure that you can support those rich media, things like Silverlight and things like Adobe Flash. Thank <laughs> you.